Hey here, I'm back some, with my next hour of one hour at a time. And so I've now, now I can move the character around. I've now added in the code to dash and to teleport. And while I am trying to stick to sort of only one hour of development at a time, and I still have managed to stick to that, I realize that sometimes if there's nothing that's been that done that interesting or I'm troubleshooting for a while, I may be a little bit more than an hour, I'm gonna try to stick to that. So, now I press play. I've added two buttons down here, and they're fairly resolution independent because I've used screen dot width and screen dot height and multiplied it by a factor so that it scales nicely and I'll move the character to the top and as you see if I move it down and press dash the character gets a dash. What I probably need to do is I need to write a, make a little bit of a cool down on the dash because at the moment you can madly just click dash and I don't want that so I want some sort of cool down which is on my list of things to do but I just haven't done that yet. Also, the special at the moment is just the teleport, so I click and it teleports to the point you were clicking to. In the future, I'd like to add a couple of extra things like invincibility, as I mentioned, but these will be random drops that you collect, and then the button appears once you collect the random drop. So next up, after now I've got these two buttons working, is I want a timer, which goes up, and I want a score, which goes up, and I'm also, to do that, I'm going to also need to make a main menu of sorts so that I've got a main menu to click to when I lose the game. So, next up is going to be, hopefully, the doing of the score and the doing of the timer.